Google has officially launched the next version of its Android operating system in the form of Android Oreo. Google has mentioned that the updates are in the carrier testing phase for the Google Pixel, the Google Pixel XL, the Nexus 5X and the 6P and these updates will reach to these devices in an OTA manner. Now with Android Oreo on our Google Pixel device, here is a list of features that you need to look forward to on Oreo. One of the first things we notice is the insanely fast boot times on Android Oreo. Now before updating the device, the Pixel clocked 50 seconds to boot from the switched off state. After the Oreo update, it just took 18 seconds, which is less than half, ensuring that the device is online much faster than before. Android apps that have new notifications will now have a dot appear on the app icon to notify you. This isn't entirely new, something similar has been available on a few devices from Samsung, Asus and HTC, which indicated the amount of unread notifications in the app. With notification dots, there is no counter, but you can long press on the icon to peek at the notification right away. With Android Oreo, you might see this feature roll out on all phones for a uniform experience. Android Oreo also introduces autofill feature that lets the operating system and apps use the autofill API to fill forms and passwords. Google can retrieve passwords saved in your account on Chrome and autofill it on your smartphone. Password managers like LastPass are working on APIs on Android Oreo so that they are able to autofill your passwords. Oreo also brings smart text selection where the OS can recognize a phone number or an address. On selecting the text, for example, a phone number, Android will display a call option along with the usual copy and cut options. The settings menu on Android that we have been used to has been redesigned with a new Oreo update. Settings are condensed and only the one Google thinks are frequently used are in the expanded view. With Oreo, Wi-Fi settings has been clubbed with networks and others with Google calling it network and internet. Similarly, other settings have also been condensed to reduce the number of options available at one go. While this may be a little confusing at first, it is pleasing to look at and easier to use. We also found Wi-Fi calling under the setting which allows it to use a Wi-Fi connection to place a call. Reliance Geo is one of the few carriers in India to support Wi-Fi calling and with this new feature you should be able to place a call through any router you're connected to. Google has gone ahead and changed the battery layout completely and it now shows statistics such as last full charge and screen on time straight away. Google has also revamped its Google Now app with the next version of Android. You have access to a lot of content now as it offers more news with the carousal to select more sources. It also gives you the option to select new actions from the ticker style menu below the search bar. Picture in picture is among the highlight for Android Oreo. This lets you minimize the video you are watching to a tiny window allowing you to work on other things at the same time. YouTube is set to have the feature but needs YouTube Red for it to work. VLC player is also set to use picture in picture and it should come to other mainstream media players soon. With Oreo, you have the option to double tap to wake the screen up in ambient mode displaying all the notifications. You also have the option to quickly reply to the message from the lock screen itself. Notifications from the music player has got a tiny update as well. When you are streaming music, the app notifications in the status bar takes up the dominant colors from the album art for the song, making boring music controls look good. Tired of allowing apps to install from unknown sources, Oreo allows you to whitelist unknown app installations from Google Chrome, Google Drive and Gmail without needing to enable unknown sources. So if you were to download an APK from your favorite site or from Gmail, it can be installed without any issue. If you are worried about rogue apps being installed on your phone, then Google has you covered. Google Play Protect is available in Oreo by default and periodically scans the phone for malware apps. It will alert you about rogue apps from time to time to keep your Android device out of danger. So these were some of the interesting features on Android Oreo. If you like this video, do give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. You can also follow us on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram at Gadgets360.